guys and welcome back to Relax My Dog. Today me and Myla are going to share with you some little tips on Border Collies. So if you would like to know a little bit more about Border Collie as a breed then do keep watching. So if you didn't already know, Milo is a Border Collie. He is about seven years old I think and his birthday is on the 6th of February. There are a few things that you can expect if you're wanting to get a Border Collie. The first one is they are extremely clever and smart. I've actually been noticing a lot in the comments that you guys have been realizing how smart and intelligent Milo is. He is so so good at different tricks and things like that and that is because Border Collies are known to be incredibly clever and they are actually a herding dog which means they always need a particular job which then means that they have an extraordinary amount of energy which Milo gets quite agitated when he has nothing to do which means that he can be quite difficult to live with um, but we love him all for that as well especially when he goes for walks he likes to let his hair down a little bit and go a bit crazy but that is just because he's getting rid of all this energy he's built up so if you live in a house that is like a flat or that doesn't have a lot of space a border collie might not be the best option because they do need a lot of running around and a lot of things to do so going along with that number two is that they need walking pretty much all day Day. and Milo has probably about two to three walks a day and um, my mum takes him on quite long walks in the morning and then we sort of split the afternoon up especially when I'm working number three is that they require quite a lot of socialization so if they are alone quite a lot of the time it can make them quite a shy dog whereas if you have them with other dogs or with humans they are quite sociable dogs and um, Milo specifically has never been brought up with any other dogs we have ne had neighbors dogs but never sort of our own so he does quite like being on his own he gets on really well with Rio our cat and we sort of think he's a bit like a human I feel like he thinks that he can sit on the sofa he does a lot of things that humans do when we walk him if a dog comes up to him he just completely ignores them he's not particularly interested by dogs more humans which is a bit of an odd one now linking in with that border collies don't do very well being alone they can get quite bad separation anxiety and um, so it's a good idea to leave like a piece of clothing that smells like you in the house when you're leaving thankfully on our house Milo is hardly ever on his own there's normally somebody in to sort of keep him company but as well as that you can also listen to the separation anxiety music that we have here on Relax My Dog if you are sort of known for going out most of the day now the next sort of fact is that their lifespan is normally between 12 to 15 years they're not particularly known to have diseases and um, only ones that are sort of related to blood but nothing else other than that but obviously this can just depend on your dog we've never had any issues with Milo Milo has been absolutely fine we've never had to take him to the vets immediately or anything like that and then the last one is quite a nice one uh, be prepared to have a companion like no other border collies are known to be extremely loyal dogs he's actually looking himself in the mirror there's a mirror right there and he's like what is this other dog and that is it for our video don't forget to give us a big thumbs up if you enjoyed and let us know down below if you have any specific tips and tricks if you have a border collie also don't forget to click the little notification bell next door to the subscribe button as that will let you be notified every single time we upload a brand new video and me and milo will see you all in our next video bye <laughs>